Mike, we've seen a big shift so far this year. We've seen a a big rotation, really a massive sector rotation where you had money coming out of technology and some of those really high beta, high octane kind of uh, growth in tech names and some of that money looking for a new home. And what you've seen is a lot of that money come into the sectors that had been left behind previously. Things like energy, things like financials, industrials, basic materials. Essentially, it's a bet that heading into a year where the Fed is probably going to start raising interest rates and heading into a year where we're coming out of the worst of the COVID-19 pandemic, people are placing bets on sectors that tend to do better in economic expansions, that tend to hold up better when the Fed does start raising interest rates, and abandoning or moving out of some of those sectors that thrive in a a low rate forever world where you're not getting much economic growth, so you need to kind of buy growth and pay up for growth from sectors like technology and from some of those hyper growth names. So it's a very big rotation. And when you see these types of moves happen, they typically have legs. It's not something that's over in a week or two, it's something that persists for months or even quarters. So definitely something investors should be aware of and something that they should be adapting to in their portfolios. 